And on the racer's right is a man who used to stand right behind him on the bench here in this building. Shot mark 10, and we'll talk a lot more about that. Sabres from right to Tarasenko plays it in behind the net. It's let right around to the near wall. Sanderson at the point. Far circle, the one-timer's not there. Back to Sanderson, keeps it in. And feeds it back down that left side. Near side for Chickard, and he one-times that one past Levi. As the defenseman pops down to pick up his second power play goal of the year, it's 1-0 Ottawa. And that is his 200th NHL point as well. And this is Sanderson going to be working on the top side here. He's going to find eventually Chickard coming across. There's a cross the scene pass right there, and Chickard had just snuck down in behind everybody. He stayed high, and I think you watch the Sabres take a quick look. They thought he was a little higher. He dropped down about 10 or 15 more feet, and bang, that's where the pass came across. Perfect pass from side to side. Bernard Docker with a shot. Traffic in front, and plenty of it, too, goes wide. Another shot Levi got a piece of. And at the far dot in the Buffalo zone, it's Krebs who lifts one out center ice. Senators come right back in. Here's McEwen with a stopper, and that one goes past Levi to give Ottawa a 2 0 lead with 7.22 to go in the first. That's his first. Yeah, it is his first. And this is probably not one of the guys you would think to be on the scoreboard here, but he did his job. Look at this, he comes in, he takes that time and space, and he's allowed to take the shot. I think a guy like this, you attack him. You try to get your stick to him, you don't pull back off him. Ryan just kind of trying to take that pass away, possibly. And he allows McEwen to take the shot. And he pulls it right past the glove of Levi. In the form of Quinn. And Ottawa able to relieve that pressure and get it out quickly. Norris will play it for Giroux. Back to Norris and Levi with a very big save there in this game. Don't kid yourself. A little give and go. You can see it right there. He just drives through, puts a stick on the ice. He gets body position on the D of the Sabres. And then the redirection. Beautiful play by Cole Giroux. He said Ottawa, they come with a lot of speed. And they try to overhandle things sometimes. But if they get through. There's Kastelik in front with a chance. Brandstrom trying to dig it in. Senators break it up. Terrace. Kubalik plays that one up ahead. Here's a two on one in. And Levi got a piece of that one. Spins around it somehow. Scrambling a little bit to try to find it, and he eventually gets on it. But Shabbat's the guy going to take the shot right here. That puck is laying right underneath him. And the quickness of Levi right there does the job because he knows it's somewhere. He knows he doesn't have it. So spin around, look behind. It's not there. And the puck comes outside the line, and Forsberg well out to play it with 22 seconds to go. Tate's Thompson looking to strip the puck here down to the near corner. Forces a quick pass. He gets it back. Here's Thompson to the net, and the shot scores! Tage Thompson was a dog after a bone with that puck from the moment he stepped on the ice and he gets rewarded as he kept digging and the Sabres are on the board trailing 2-1 to one with 13.4 seconds to go in the period. And you're right, he was pressuring, he's got his stick, he's got an active stick the whole time there and here's where it all happens and he creates that turnover and stays with it but what he does is... Hunter at the end of that first period and he was rewarded. We'll see what that does for the Sabres psyche here in this second period. Buffalo zone. He's double teamed below the goal line. Puck comes back up top. Courtesy of Stutzla. He turns it over and we've got a breakaway here. Up to the goal with a backhand save made on Paterka. But the rebound! Stutzla with a stop on Skinner. Period. Stutzla very sloppy at the line. Skeets into three Sabres. This is Paterka coming down on the breakaway. Looks to go five hole. And then Sinsla has to make the save on Skinner, who's kind of come in. And he's going to get the rebound here after the save is made. Being here, 18. Uh, I think the big thing is here in the second period, you're not allowing Ottawa to come flying up the ice with a ton of speed. They're not catching in those odd man rushes going up the ice. So you're doing a much better job on coverage. Here's a chance as they get to the net with a two on one and score at the end of the day. They kept driving the net and it results. Sabres are trying to negate, and Kubelik picks up the goal, and it's 3-1 Ottawa. And Kubelik's going to get his eighth goal here. And right here, he's the one that starts it off in his zone. Duggan, he's just a nice little move there, gets in the middle of everybody, and he just kind of reaches back. And Jack Quinn gets a piece of this, but he just doesn't get all of it, and it just allows him to throw that puck to the net. He
Skinner draws the pressure. Sabres working around with a far circle. Dahlin keeping it in at the line. Potential two-on-one short-handed here for Ottawa. Middlestat fighting to get back, and he does! And a shot still on goal and a save by Levi. To do a good job back-checking here. Here's Claude Giroux. He's got the puck, and he's going. He's a two-on-one, and Middlestat just does what he can and just hounds Giroux as much as possible. Zemius Gergensen wins it out of the corner, back to the line. Power plays over, shot though by Yoki Haru to the net, stopped, and then trying to bank that one in was Kyle Pozo from behind the center. Is in front, and that one missed by Forsberg as he waved the glove at it from the shot from Krebs, but it stayed out. Team to four in the second period, and this is the last opportunity. Kyle Pozo behind the net tries to feed it out twice. JJ Paterka gets a chance, it slips by Gergensen's the first time right there. He whiffs on it, Paterka gets a piece of it, and it goes, I want to let them win this one clean and give them another opportunity. They do win it, not incredibly clean as trying to play it as Dylan Cousins without a stick, and then it's up into the air and over the glove of Devin Levi. And exactly what you were talking about. You didn't want to give them a moment. They found one with 15.7 seconds left in the second period. It's 4-1. to one. And just right here, Dylan Cousins grabs it he doesn't have a stick he comes up and he grabs it and he puts it down but he lays it right on the stick of the ottawa senator right there he's just kind of thrown to the net and 12 going to get a piece of it as he's going by just pushes it through goes right over the left well devin levi and his mates have some work to do and we're not going to say happy new year until the sabers have tied this thing up and sent it over time razor third period sabers need three in this frame against the ottawa senators Kyle Pozo out with Krebs and Paterka. But Ottawa with their fifth goal of the year on a quick shot by Kelly right in the slot to extend the lead to five to one. And here they are. Sabres under put them under pressure there, but it just kind of thrown into the zone. You see about five guys in the middle, but Kelly once again right in, in the middle of them. There's a whole pile of guys there, but he's able to get the shot off. Everybody just kind of... I think it's an offside challenge. Yeah, the linesmen are at the box, so that would be the offside. Uh, Kubelik's across. Yes, it was. Please reset the clock to 13.32. Great shot. So it remains a three-goal deficit. Four to one Ottawa, and the draw will come outside the Sabres blue line. Yeah, that's a good call by Matt Smith and Justin White in the room. But hang on. Yeah. Well, <laughs> some guys you don't want breaking a knuckle in a fight that means nothing because you do want them for the rest of the season. Yeah. Now that's kind of the thinking there. Levi with a big save, but that puck sent to the net. And then he comes across a big splits right there, and. An opportunity for Norris that's driving through to the net and Giroux just waiting time and Levi time that one for Quinn down to help out takes it to the far corner Senators will bring three out towards center ice quick pass up ahead and a shot stopped by Levi he'll hold on to it under five to go middle stat off a skate that one and it won't be kept in at the line his power has to retrieve it and take it back to center ice and he turns it over to Zub and a backhander in the empty net. Makes it 5-1. He's given a gift here, shall we say. Yeah, he is. Great play, great time. Read that perfectly, and he picks it up on the backhand, throws it down, gets a third. Connor Clifton. Able to skate it up to center ice. He's going to take what they give him here, right to the net with a backhand. Forsberg to save. And the Senator is able to clear it out. The defensive play in front of Stutzla only could get one hand on that one. He said with him, he got the puck past him right here, but he turns and just keeps his body on him. And Stutzla only reaches out with a one. Against Kyle Pozo. Should will lift that one into the Buffalo zone. Levi thinking about coming out to help challenge on this play. And it's swept to the post. Is it in? The referee's going to take a look at it. But Levi appears to have kept this one out. Here, I couldn't tell if it was. Let's take a look and see if we can see anything right here, Branson. Just no quit here, and he's just firing it around. 
And the teams ahead of you, as I say, Montreal is a point up on you, and Pittsburgh yeah, is hey, this four. Is next game, and you got to try to win it. You know, you put 40, almost 50 shots on the net here tonight. You just can't.